Hello everyone. I hope all of you are doing well. As you might be aware of, the gate results are already out, and we have with us a very special guest here to discuss his preparation journey and how he made it to uh, rank ten at the gate twenty two. So we have Pratyush with us here. Uh, Pratyush, we would just like to know as to what exactly has your journey been like till now. What is it that you're doing, and what are your plans going ahead? Uh, yes, sir. Good morning. uh first of all i'll say that uh, everyone has to keep in mind that uh, no matter like if you attempted for first time or if you attempted already first time or if you are attempting again uh, you you need to be take it in your mind that uh, it is not that difficult eight exams first of all you need to be like that. then uh, uh, you you need to like uh, first of all clarify your concepts that is main you need to get a clear clarity on your concepts if you don't have clarity then i suggest that you join a coaching or uh, you read textbooks or whatever fits you mm-hmm. then what happens is some people just uh, do concepts with clarity and they think that okay we got full concepts we can attempt the gate exam but that is also mm-hmm. wrong again then you have to practice you have to just practice you need to do previous year questions you need to solve materials Hmm. and uh, you need to attempt test series test series are also very important like they will give you the idea of the gate exam and they will tell you like now if you read the concepts yeah i know you will say but if you do attempt the test series then you will know how much conceptual clarity you have hmm. that is why these these three things are main important so conceptual clarity practice and test series if you do this perfectly then everybody will get good rank Yeah, yeah. So very well said, Pratyush. So again, content is one part of the entire journey. Uh, strategy and knowing yourself as a candidate, as an individual, is is definitely uh, a different part of the journey, right? So how has your journey been, Pratyush? So what what happened when you attempted the gate? As in, what was your experience like uh, throughout? Yes, sir. This is actually years, right? my second attempt. First attempt, I attempted. like i was still uh, doing uh, <clears throat> my mast my bachelor degree and mm-hmm. during that time i attempted simultaneously this gate exam mm-hmm. uh, i was not satisfied with that result like i got around 4000 rank uh, so this time this year i have fully devoted myself to gate only like i i only got up in the morning uh, read some concepts solve some problems like that and uh, in the last two months what i did was i only gave full length tests and i pra- i used revision notes and i revised three times all concepts and i used to practice sums like from the test series which i got wrong and uh, this helped me a lot in uh, developing my conceptual clarity like where i am doing mistakes what i need to study more uh, like mm. how i am getting marks like in two months i attempted so many tests i on an average how i am getting where i stand how i need to improve these things all i did and in the final exam i wrote the exam and i got good grades okay so so what was your experience like during the test as in any any point in time where you felt that you are going to get a, a good rank or you felt that okay things were not going as well as you had planned to and that's why you wanted to sort of uh, do a better job yes sir um uh, like uh, for this test series for this year test like many people from mechanical might know that uh, it was very difficult on seeing the questions itself we can know that uh, there are some uh, good concepts like we need to think a lot while attempting the questions so what i did was uh, uh, i first glance through whole paper sir like quick glance i read all questions hmm. then i started solving like from first first question itself i did not uh, do like first i have to do one marks then two marks like that i didn't do i started hmm. like whatever order has been given to me in my set hmm. i use that and solve the questions Uh, like if i didn't know any question i understood that the paper was difficult after reading this quick lens then mm. i felt okay for me if it is difficult then almost like everybody will feel difficult like nobody will say ah this year paper is easy i didn't feel any difficulty at all even the first ranker right. might so i am saying uh, like if i don't know any question i left it and i proceeded to the second question i mm. like you should not care like uh, if i'm leaving this question i might lose two marks i might lose one mark don't feel like that you need not get yourself demotivated there are still so many questions you can you can get in that questions good marks hmm hmm so yeah. you, i felt like this and i attempted sir like i did after getting the result only i saw that i got 10th rank for that i was not expecting this 
ओके ओके बट बट इट मेक्स सेंस आई थिंक यू हैव टू कीप योर ईगो आउटसाइड द टेस्ट लैब और योर टेस्ट सेंटर अलोंग विद योर बिलोंग टू डूइंग द टेस्ट यू नीड टू थिंक अबाउट द टेस्ट ओन इफ यू थिंक अबाउट द रिजल्ट देन इट विल अफेक्ट करेक्ट या दोस दो सर लाइक इट्स रियली वाइज वर्ड प्रत्युष दैट इज बेसिकली हाउ यू शुड थिंक बिकॉज़ Uh, a lot of aspirants go ahead of themselves get ahead of themselves and start thinking about the result which they don't have any control over right? yeah uh, everybody so, will have certain expectation in their mind like what they do what they want to do after the exam they'll mm-hmm. think about that expectation but first yes. if in order to reach that expectation you need to give your test correctly so that is what you have great great nice nice so um pratish what would you like to advise all the aspirants who are just beginning with their preparation or who might have taken gate 22 but might have not done well so what should they do in the coming year uh, to better their chances yes sir for first attempters like this is the first time they are attempting uh, they will attempt in fourth year i guess so i am mm-hmm. saying uh, uh, whatever they teach you in college they will teach you but uh, you need to think in a gate oriented way like you need to see all the formulas concepts which are important for gate and you need mm-hmm. to get very good concepts of clarity and attempt some test series then uh, you you will get good rank for second attempters i think like in at least in my case i'm saying like test series and all i used to didn't do that well in in my first attempt so mm-hmm. what you have to do you know see everybody who had attempted first in the gate they know conceptuals and all everybody knows but you need to practice more for second attempts because you know the concepts you have an advantage over first attempts so what you need to do to get good rank you need to practice more sums you need to give more test series and you need to analyze your mistakes simply giving one test after the other test day after day after day after it is not good on hmm. test you take you you attempt you will get some wrong then what you do uh, you see those mistakes and if you don't know any concept i suggest you write it down it will be helpful while revise Hmm. This month I am saying, yeah. don't I, every some people are, I am saying that some people are neglecting test series. It is not wrong. Test series is very important part of get. Hmm. Hmm. Because again, the the real time reaction to whatever situation you come across is very important, right? There will be like any any academy test series you take, there will be a lot of range. Like some papers will be easy, some papers will be very difficult. if hmm. you do all those papers then you will get an idea like how you can do if the paper comes very difficult how you will do if the paper comes very easy like that hmm. okay great so uh, pratish what are your plans going ahead what is it that you want to do yes sir i am more uh, inclined towards doing master specialization only than seeking a government job okay okay great 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 okay So Pratyush uh thank you so much for taking out the time to interact yes. with uh, all the viewers that we have and uh, really wise words uh, of course as in uh, what you mentioned made a lot of sense you have to sort of have a plan in place first of all uh, yes, if you don't really succeed maybe the first time you should know what exactly went wrong instead of just blaming yourself for whatever mistakes might have or whatever results might have happened uh, and then obviously if you keep on working methodically towards it then definitely uh, you have you have it in it to in you to be successful right yes so very well said pratyush uh, again uh, thank you so much for joining us i'm sure everybody would have gained a lot from your experience thank you my pleasure okay okay thank you pratyush and uh, for all the viewers out there we'll have more such uh, interviews more such interactions coming up for you as well so stay tuned to the channel and uh, definitely all the best with the preparation as well sure thanks